What's up everybody and welcome back to another gold farm. Today we're located in Frostfire Ridge. We're located way, way here on the western side. So for Horde, it's very, very, very simple. Your garrison is located right here and you just fly directly northwest. For Alliance, it's a little bit harder and a little bit more time consuming to get here. So if you are Alliance, I suggest maybe coming on a flight point and then maybe leaving a character here that you don't really care about or play that often because it is kind of a trek to be completely honest. For Horde, however, it's much, much easier to just fly over here whenever you feel like it after using your garrison hearth. But anyway, why are we over here? Because this guy right in front of me, Nock Karash, has a 100% chance to drop a mount for us. Now the mount, I believe in Draenor, used to be really, really, really over farm. The benefit is now I've been standing here for I think at least 10 minutes and I've kind of been watching the sky to see if anyone's going to come down. This is my other character up here. Um, so I've been waiting to see if anyone else would come down and kill this guy for us, but no one has come quite yet. So I was doing this on stream yesterday and it looked like it was like the middle of the day and there was one person here. So this is definitely more of a forgotten farm, I feel like. I mean, obviously there could be some people on your server who know about this and still sell them out. But for the most part, I feel like a lot of people don't really come out to Draenor anymore, which works out really, really, really well for us because the price has definitely gone up a little bit. Now, it's hard to argue that this is really, really, really valuable, especially when it drops 100% of the time because you don't have like some of our rare items that we go after. It has like a 1% chance to drop, which means that even if you do find the rare up, uh, you still have a really, really high chance of not getting the item. So this is a guaranteed drop, which means that the price won't be as high because you're going to have so many people who once they come out and get it, they do have it, right? So if I were you, I would maybe leave a character out here for about an hour. According to Wowhead, it looks like he spawns every 18 to 20 minutes. So I, I left my other character that you saw, uh, I left her over here and set up a timer and it's it's been about 20 minutes. So really, really quick on the respawn, 100% chance to drop, which is nice because it means you can add one more item to your auction house listing. But let's go ahead and kill it. Actually first, so this mount that I'm on, before I de dismount myself, this is the mount that you're going to receive. If you don't have it learned already, it is kind of a cool mount. It basically is these wolves right here, except you have a little saddle on it. So now let's, let's get our, not Karash right here. And there you go. There's our Garn Night Howl. If I could just... Perfect. Okay. So, if you look at it, it has a 0.36 sell rate, which is absolutely fantastic. Which is why I 100% I recommend that you come out here and get a couple of them because they have such a crazy high sell rate. Now, on my server, they're only going for 850 gold. But you know what? I'm okay with that because I can leave a character out here and kill Garn whenever he is, or not Garn, uh, not Karash whenever he is up because that is such a fantastic sell rate on a mount. Uh, looks like region average daily sold is 3.24, so that's really, really good. That's much higher than a lot of transmog. Now the region market value is 2.7k, so really, really, really good for coming out here, honestly. If I didn't know it already, I probably would learn the first one and then post the rest of the auction house. Um, but hopefully it is a little bit more expensive on your server. 850 gold is still pretty good. I would probably post a transmog if it was worth that amount. So pretty happy with that amount price. But yeah, so I would set up a timer, come out here, especially if you're Horde. So I'm currently on war mode and I don't know if that would make a difference either. I've just wanted to point that out as well. I haven't seen anybody. When I was playing yesterday, I had war mode off and I did see someone up here. But I, like I said, I haven't seen anybody yet. So definitely come out, recommend you do it. Get yourself a couple mounts. I don't even need to say good luck because you will absolutely get this. So guys, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, uh, please consider following the channel and like the video and all that fun stuff. But guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye.